Hi boys and girls, today we are using bleeding tissue paper to make a background and some um, water for our underwater sea turtles that we are creating. So when we use this tissue paper um, and overlap it and add water to it, it kind of makes a cool tie-dye effect to create an awesome background for our sea turtle. We know that on our color wheel, we have our warm colors that are all next to each other and our cool colors. The warm and cool colors mix well together, so we are going to use all cool colors for the background of our sea turtle. So what you will do is you will write your first and last name and class code on the back of your square piece of paper. Flip that over and then you are going to start to lay down some pieces of this bleeding tissue paper and you want to lay a few pieces of paper down. You want to have a variety of these cool colors. So blue, green, and there's a few different shades of green. There's kind of a blue green that you can put in. And these pieces are all different sizes too and then there's kind of a pinkish purple that we can use. And you're going to just overlap these pieces and once you get a few pieces of paper on to help them so that they don't go flying or moving too far notice how they're overlapping the edges of them are overlapping then you will add water to them so i have this corner kind of all laid down my pieces are overlapping that way the colors will mix because again we know that those cool colors mix well together so now I'm um, dipping my large paintbrush into water now. Um, I don't want my brush dripping wet with water, so I can kind of tap it. But this will make it so that my tissue paper stays down. It's okay if it crumples up a little bit like that, but you do kind of want to hold it down so that it sticks to your paper. And again, overlapping, and you want it to go all the way to the edge. And you want to use quite a bit of water when you're doing this. So now that I have all those pieces stuck down with water, I'll just continue to add more. Again, just make sure that you're overlapping that paper and you're using a variety of shapes and cool colors for the background of your project. Swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. What do we do? We swim, swim. Dorino singing. Oh, 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 oh. When you are finished, just make sure every piece has water on it and it's all stuck down really well. Um, then you can raise your hand and Miss W will help you get this onto the drying rack and you will have an awesome background ready to go the next time that you come into art class.